Hello guys, this is Abhishek. Uh, welcome back to the PhoneGap video tutorial. Today, I'm uh, um, we're gonna talk about the new plugin called Battery Status in PhoneGap. How we can use this application and uh, use this plugin in our application, whether in Android or in iOS. Okay, this is the same code, so you don't worry about uh, the uh, if it is running properly in uh, iOS. Okay, if you copy or paste your uh, code. Uh, in the iOS project, it will run perfectly without any error. Okay, so uh, first of all, here I have a project called uh, plugin project, and I have uh, already installed uh, the plugin called oarch.apache.codeoar.battery dash status. Okay, uh, this battery status plugin gives me the three different events. Okay, uh, the battery status event, battery critical event, and battery low events okay uh, from these three events I can get a written parameter uh, object as an object if you want to see uh, all the details of the object you can use the JSON dot stringify bracket and the written object it will alert you all the uh, parameters written by these events okay so how to use this event that uh, I'm gonna show you but one more thing you have to remember that this events get fired automatically okay you do not need to uh, get the uh, you do not need to call these events okay whenever the percentage of a battery changes okay uh, that means right now uh, my battery is on a 35 percent and uh, I'm using the application and suddenly it becomes uh, the 36 percent or the lowest on a 30 percent okay plus one or minus one okay if the battery status increase plus one or decreases the minus one that time the all three events will get fired okay so uh, if your battery status is on uh, current state so you will not get uh, this event okay so here just I need to copy add event listener and after that the battery status section sorry event okay just copy over here and uh, I'll just copy this one also and I'm create a new function with the name okay and uh, this function will return a uh, object okay I'm calling it info whatever you want to do okay and after that if you want if you do not uh, know uh, what are the parameters are available in info so you can do like this json dot stringify bracket info okay uh, it will give you all the information and after that you can access that uh, parameters by using like a level okay uh, this will give you the level that means the percentage of the battery status and after that info dot is plugin sorry plug plugged P L U G okay or uh, you can also get uh, all the information from the official plugin.codeover.io site where you can get all the information related to the plugin okay so here is the plugged okay is plugged parameter so just use that parameter is plugged and I'll just remove this okay and same way just copy this two times because we have a more events and uh, the events are here battery crit critical I'll just put it over here and also on battery and the last one is the battery low okay you can also use a single uh, event to detect everything okay uh, just use the battery status you do not need to use the battery low or the critical okay so do not forget to create all the functions otherwise uh, project will not work properly info and uh, battery low info I'm giving the same alert over in all the functions okay just write the 
which event is firing so we can uh, detect it properly okay and uh, I'm just giving an alert that means the everything is working properly that I can get the proper message for that okay so we'll just run this application now okay that means the plugins are loaded successfully okay and now I'm not getting any alert for this okay uh, I'll get the alert when I using the applications and uh, the percentages of battery get changed okay uh, if you want to see over here the events fires when the percentage of the battery charges charge changes by at least one percent or if the device is uh, plugged in our in or uh, unplugged okay and the both status uh, they even get fired right so uh, if I uh, unplug the device then uh, I'll get lost my connection so I couldn't show you that so at once you can uh, work with the battery status plugin so I hope you have understood whatever I have explained over here uh, if you want uh, if you want if you have any questions you can post it on my YouTube channel uh, please uh, make uh, please uh, if you have any suggestions then uh, just send it to me uh, I'll create a new project or whatever your uh, you have a, I'll try to solve that okay and uh, thank you for watching guys and uh, do not forget to subscribe my channel till then bye bye